What's going on, YouTube? Mike back with another TTM recap episode. Got only one return today. Was expecting two. Something didn't show up that I was expecting. Hopefully, it'll arrive tomorrow. We'll see. So, I got one return in today, and it is coming from Pat Nishak, who you guys know I've gotten from many times. He is, in my opinion, the number one signer in professional sports. Uh, really happy to add these to the collection. I actually sent him a priority mailbox um, full of some customs and stuff for him to pass along to fellow collectors and fans. And uh, he sent back uh, what he sent back. So really happy to get these back. I think he sent back 11 items signed. And this return was in four days. Um, I sent it out. It probably got to him the next day via priority mail. Signed it and uh, sent it right back. So really happy to get this in back. The first one here is this 2017 Topps Gypsy Queen. Beautiful looking card. Really uh, looks nice with that blue signature. Happy to add it to the collection. Uh, big fan of Gypsy Queen. And uh, this one turned out really well. So happy to add Nishak to the Nishak PC and the Phillies PC. If you guys haven't sent to Pat and you're a TTM collector or you're just getting started, I've said it many times. He's one of the best. And uh, if not the best, I actually think he is the best. Uh, he's certainly the best of current players. You know, Door, Bobby Door, Hall of Famer, probably gets the nod for all-timer. But here's a few customs. So I sent him like 25 of each of these. Uh, this is the Philadelphia Signature Collection. So I have blank ones of these that I've sent off uh, to many players. I have the Ballpark Heroes and the Philadelphia Signature Collection. I send them off as extras uh, sometimes if I just need one extra thing signed. Or I'll bring them IP in case I run into someone that I don't have a card of. So I kind of experimented with putting a player on one. Figured Nishak was the guy to do it too. And uh, signed it. So it's pretty cool. I like it. Definitely cool for the PC. Then I sent these uh, classic collections. You guys recognize them. I did the customs of myself and Burke Waldron and have done some others. Uh, sent him 25 of these. He returned two of them. And uh, hopefully some of you guys will have some of these popping into your mailbox sometime soon. Unfortunately, the signatures didn't turn out as well on these as I would have liked. Uh, specifically this one. The other one's not uh, not too bad. It's not real, real sharp, though. Uh, it's probably this crummy stock. I actually used a cheaper service than I usually use. Uh, only because you can get less stuff printed. And I didn't necessarily want to uh, spend the money to have a run of 500 printed. But uh, very cool. I like the overall design, so happy to add them to the personal collection. Definitely a little more personal when you kind of create the card. So then I also have a few photos here. Jones Nation had sent me a message and asked me to uh, make a Pat Nishak custom for him for the World Baseball Classic, so I was happy to do so. Liked the way it turned out, so I went ahead and had some print it for myself. Uh, Told him I only needed one back, but he signed three of them. So if anyone's interested in these, uh, feel free to send me a message. Let me know. Um, definitely very cool. Um, really like the way they turned out. And uh, these are nice 5 by 7s there. So very cool. And let's see. Oh, then I had a, just some other Philly stuff I was fooling around with. Three more of these. Again, only really need one. Turned out pretty well. Um, probably would look really good with the uh, paint pen um, that I have here, this the brighter blue. Um, but not bad at all. Very cool. Again, he sent three of these. Um, so I'm happy with this for the collection. And then I just experimented with the uh, high gloss one. I like the matte finishes much better. But uh, experimented with this highly glossy one. Um, not just regular glossy. Uh, I forget the name of the uh, print. But turned out pretty well as... Well, uh, I like the other one, though, a little bit better. I think the blue pops a little bit on the matte finish. So, guys, comment below. Let me know what you think of these additions to the Pat Nishak collection. You like the customs? You don't like them? Is there something I could have done better? Feel free to uh, to let me know. If someone needs uh, an extra one of these photos, um, message me. And... Uh, Besides that, I hope you guys have yourselves a great weekend. Hopefully, uh, the TTM collectors out there get some stuff in. If you guys sent to Pat Nishak recently, maybe you'll get some of my customs. And that's it, guys. So comment below, hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll talk to you next time. Have a great one.